everyone. I hope you are doing well today. Um, it is about the afternoon now. Time is like flying by this week. Woo-wee! Um, but I just wanted to say again, thank you so much for uh, participating in the giveaway. And I am so excited for Alex for winning the bouquet, which that should be arriving to her um, next week is when she wanted it delivered. So I'm excited to see how that all works out for her. Um, but again, I just wanted to say thank you. Like I'm up to, you know, over 10,000 subscribers now, and I'm just really honored and thankful for, um, your support. And, um, if you go back to the giveaway video, I did this whole thing that I read off what I was thinking about early in the morning one day. So, um, if you haven't seen that, go back and watch that. But I, the more I was thinking about it, expanding on that little speech that I wrote, um, I don't really, ha I didn't really have a way to communicate with you guys outside of YouTube, really, on it, except for, you know, in other Rose groups. So I decided, you know what, it's probably time I go ahead and create a Summer Moon Garden Facebook page. So that's what I did. I created a or a Facebook group and it's called Summer Moon Garden. I would love for you to join it if you want to be part of my community. I really just want to foster a community where we can all just talk about roses. And I, I'm like an inspirational quote type of person. So I'll be posting inspirational quotes on there. Um, anything that brings positivity and light and joy, that's what I want that Facebook group to emulate. So I would love it if you would go check it out. I'm actually going to post the link to the group in the um, description below. So please click on that and please join. I would love to have you part of the group. Um, and that's really all I wanted to mention so far in this video, except next week we are finally starting on the backyard to put in the grass and the irrigation and all this, these fun things are about to happen. We're just patiently, I say patiently because it's not really patiently waiting, um, but we are patiently waiting for the county to come out and mark um, all the different utility lines and, and cable lines and things like that. Um, so our landscapers can start uh, digging and laying down all the, the sod and doing the irrigation and laying the um, border stone path. Oh, I'm just so excited. And they're going to move the trampoline. So y'all know I've been talking about doing this for about a year now, maybe not, maybe not a full year, but pretty darn close. I've been wanting it to happen for over a year. So I'm really, really excited about this project and I cannot wait to show you the whole process. It's going to be absolutely lovely. And then I'm also, um, pretty sure that I'm actually going to be expanding a bed in the front. I'm going to be connecting. Um, maybe I can get up and show you exactly what I'm talking about. So the mail, the front bed of the mailbox, and then there's a the little bit of grass and then there's the bed with the Japanese maple. I am considering taking out all the grass in between those two beds and then connecting the beds and making one nice little streamlined bed there. I have bought so many roses this past year that I need the space. Like I, there's no way I can, I bought like over 50 roses again this spring, which was not smart on my part. Um, cause I don't have room for all of them. So I'm having to make another bed to make room for them. Um, but I'm actually kind of excited about it cause it just means more beautiful flowers. So I'm okay with it. My husband's not very excited about it cause he doesn't want me touching any more grass. Um, but I told him, you know what? Don't worry, honey. It's going to be beautiful. So <laughs> you know how that goes, right ladies? Um, or gents too, who are more of the gardener than their spouse, right? Um, anyway, so that's kind of what's going on. Um, I am in the process of uploading another video where I show my awesome son, Jeff, helping me plant up the Sweet Drift Rose Hedge up front and just doing a few other little things around the garden. So I'm in the process of working on that. But I just wanted to make this quick little video and just say thank you so much for 
supporting me and um, I hope that you've learned a lot along the way over the years. I know I have, I've learned a whole lot myself to be honest. So um, again, just thank you so much and I cannot wait to show you the progress of everything that's about to happen. So hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.